right. So going into, all right, so I'm going to keep going that line about the corrupted teachers. All of them are, all of them have some level of corruption because we're all, we're, you know, this, this whole um, takeover thing has been going on for eons. It's not just a few thousand years, a hundred thousand years or whatever. I mean, each race that has their hand in seeding the DNA, seeding the humans here, you know, had their own little twist to it. So like, you know, we talk about Palladians all the time. Guys, Palladians are not all benevolent. There's a lot of corrupted Palladian teachings out there. Just know that. It's corrupted. Uh, the Galactic Federation, that's another level of, of frame up of corruption, of, of your connection to the all that is to source. So, you, you know, these names that are really well known within the light worker world, because they're of higher dimensional frequency, there's an assumption that they're all benevolent. It's like, no, it's just a more refined game of power over dynamics. It's a more refined, let's say, testing ground of where you are in your sovereignty. So because of the, if you look at it as a testing ground, where you are in your sovereignty, how you are able to create a relationship, a healthy relationship with these beings, then you're going in, in a way that's going, you're going to come out even more empowered on the other side. Okay. But as soon as beings are like, no, you got to bow and worship me before I'm willing to do anything, then no, say no, see ya, you know, see ya, no big deal. There's someone else that was going to want to work with me. <laughs> I'm a powerful multidimensional being figuring shit out. There's someone else that's going to want to help me. If you don't want to help me because I'm not this or that or whatever, see ya next, you know, and believe me, there's a long line of beings, long line of beings. I'm, I'm talking about a long line of beings going to the sun and back a thousand times that are waiting in the wings to work with you. Okay, because you are a powerful, infinite being in a bio suit waking up to your multidimensional sovereignty. You are a very powerful ally to have, okay, in this reality. And this reality is potent. Yes, it's all a dream because there are all these nesting dolls are in the dreamscapes coming together to create this reality. But it doesn't mean it's not significant. It doesn't mean that it's not powerful or uh, potent for a ground of evolving consciousness you know, and that's what the game is about, evolving consciousness, evolving DNA, creating a platform where a being can become an evolved, a highly evolved being in just a few, um, few million years. Because in the past, what's happened is that it took billions upon billions upon billions upon billions upon billions of years to create a highly evolved consciousness. Now, imagine coming to this planet and getting it done in a couple million years. That's something that is a major feat. Okay. So this don't let people tell you that these are just meat bags. You're in a meat suit and this is just a dream. This reality, it doesn't matter because that too is a bullshit program. 